As always, we have a bunch of study questions. In this case, you will not have the book to back you up, but do go through this. And in particular, if you're in Stockholm, by combining this with the lab, you're going to be perfectly on top of these simple simulations. The one part that is probably important to know from the lectures are these final parts about free energies, delta delta G values, and the free energy cycle, because that we might not cover as much in the lab. But otherwise, now you should be able to simulate things and see what happens and check me whether I was right or wrong. And in the next lecture, we will be able to head back to look at actual protein structures.